good models and gentlemen, my parents, my friends, it's Presley again. Today, in this beautiful Sunday, the scripture reading will get it from the book of Mark, chapter 10, verses 46 and down. You see, this is a story of when Jesus healed blind Bartimaeus. The story happened in Jericho. As you know that Jericho is the oldest city in the world. And many things which Jesus performed, he performed them in, in Jericho. For those who doesn't know, Jericho is more than 10,000 years of age. So that's, what, that's the oldest city in the world. So many miracles Jesus performed around the city of Jericho and Mount of Temptation and with Zacchaeus, when he told Zacchaeus to come down from the fig tree and stuff like that. But then there was a guy whom the Bible refers to as Bartimaeus. So Bartimaeus is not the name of a person. Bar means the son of. And Timaeus, which means that, that, that guy, the Bible does not, never told us his name. He, 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 the Bible only referred him as the son of Timaeus. So this son was ill or he was blind. So he was begging next to the road. And when Jesus approached, Bartimaeus spoke with a loud voice. He said, Jesus, the son of David. You see, I want to, to, to I understand uh, that now, now, now we are talking of heritage and stuff like that, but I want us to dwell on the lineage. You see, the, the thing is, many a time we speak about only generational curses. We don't speak of generational blessings. You see, the blind man, he did not say, Jesus, the son of Joseph <laughs> and Mary. No, he said, Jesus, the son of David, because he's in the lineage of David. What does that mean? It means even wherever you are, wherever you come from, your, your son name or your lineage or bloodline has something positive. Hmm? You, you, you find they speak much of the negative thing about their lineage, about their clan. But this blind man recognized that he is the son of David because he's in the lineage of David. And who's David? David is the guy who killed Goliath. So you see, it's very much important that we as people, we should acknowledge those who lived before us, who were, who were, who were more stronger. Uh, positive. They are positive things. But dwell on the positive things. And you, you know, you praise the lineage. You can not so much on the negative sort of attitude. No. Check on the good things which your family has been endorsing before you were. There's nothing wrong about praising your ancestors because what is happening is that you are coming from them. They're the people who lived before you. So this blind Bartimaeus, he is praising Jesus through David because David was the forefather. So from today, I, 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 I praise any where we're coming from and 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 let and 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 you will see our, our thing will get build confidence to ourselves and also to our kids and also to our generation that is very much important and I thank you and I think we'll take this with good faith. Amen and amen.